summer and early fall are the most popular times for weddings, and there's new data that shows the celebration isn't just expensive for the bride and groom. As WBZ's Courtney Cole shows us tonight, some wedding guests are taking on debt just to go to the celebration. So before you start figuring out your position to catch the bouquet or the garter, let's get straight to the numbers from a recent lending tree survey. So 40% of you that attended a wedding in the last five years have taken on a debt just to be there. 32% of you who were a part of the wedding party, you've piled up at least $500 in debt. And believe it or not, according to this survey, it's the fellas, the groomsmen, who are more likely to fall into debt than the bridesmaids and spend more. I think some of it is just that weddings themselves are getting bigger in scope. And it used to be that a destination wedding might have been a little less common. It might have been that a bachelor or bachelorette trip was something that people did, but not maybe as many people do. And I think that all of those things um, have become more and more common now and more and more kind of expected as part of, of the wedding process. So what can you do to navigate that debt and perhaps maybe even prevent it altogether? Schultz, you just heard from there at Lending Tree, says start putting money aside sooner rather than later. Put it into a high-yield savings account. And don't be afraid to talk to other members of the wedding party or even others that are attending. Get that conversation going about maybe splitting room costs or even a rental car. And last but certainly not least, use those credit card rewards to your advantage. They can be especially helpful. Free hotel, free airfare, anything you can get free or discount it throughout this process will certainly make a difference. And let's just remember, we know it can be tough to go to a friend or family member and say it's kind of hard for you to fit all of this into your budget, but at the end of the day, the bride and groom likely don't want you to go broke to attend their ceremony. Courtney Cole, WBZ News.